Hi guys, I hope it is a good news for you. I am going to give most important frequently asking general science chemistry questions and standard model problems which will be very useful for RRB, SSC CGL, NTPC and all other GOAT charts. So hurry up to subscribe my channel for more number of series of general science chemistry videos and to join best online courses visit chemmasters.online or download mobile app chemmasters so here in this lecture we are going to check out 25 most important and frequently asking questions here as a part one okay just look at the first question which is used in the treatment of indigestion okay right we have given with four options aspirin calcium carbonate antibiotic steroid here the answer is b that is calcium carbonate used in the treatment of indigestion so we can take calcium carbonate as as in the powdered form or as a chewing tablet or just a normal tablet whereas aspirin is a painkiller and also used to lower the body temperature okay and here antibiotics can you say some examples for it erythromycin tetracyclines we know best tetracyclines are as antibiotics okay and some steroids so here steroids antibiotic and aspirins uh, uh, which are taken up by human being they lead to indigestion okay so here so to treat indigestion calcium carbonate should be taken okay answer is b for it now we need to look at the second question on a clean glass plate water uh, glass plate water drop spreads to form a thin layer whereas a drop of mercury remains almost spherical due to here we have four options just look at them density of mercury is greater than that of water cohesion of mercury is greater than its addition with glass cohesion of water is greater than its addition with glass and density of water is greater than mercury okay here answer is b that is cohesion of mercury is greater than its addition with glass so here uh, to understand the information or the concept for the given problem we need to know the word that means the meaning of the words cohesion and addition okay here cohesion is a measure of how well a molecule sticks with its uh, uh, groups okay so simply cohesive force or absorbed between similar molecules okay so here I mean mercury all the mercury molecules are attracted by cohesive forces that's why here and uh, the mercury drop it remains spherical in shape okay so what is addition so here uh, addition forces are absorbed between dissimilar molecules so that is addition is a process of attachment of a substance to the surface of another substance that means here if we take a water drop okay so water drop is uh, uh, is simply having uh, addition forces with glass surface so those uh, addition those forces are simply considered as addition okay addition forces uh, forces right now so simply here what we said cohesion forces of mercury is greater than uh, its addition with glass so that's why so due to internal forces uh, which are strong enough to make spherical in shape for that mercury so here option b is the correct answer and next question the principle involved in hydrogen bomb is so simply the answer is nuclear fusion okay so in hydrogen bomb so here hydrogen molecules are fused okay so to produce helium and here nuclear fush, uh, fusion is the principle involved in hydrogen bomb so in atomic bomb simply nuclear fission is the principle observed okay right and next question blue color of glass is a due to so just check out uh, we have given with four options so simply cupric oxide and cobalt oxide sodium peroxide chromium oxide okay so the answer is b that is cobalt oxide 
the blue color of glass is due to cobalt oxide so whenever we use cup uh, cupric oxide in uh, glass then which leads to the color that is simply uh, it produces a green a yellow and uh, other brown colors that means the different compounds of copper produces different colors now sodium peroxide and next one we have taken chromium oxide so whenever we use chromium oxide in glass which produces a simply emerald green color to the glass and next question uh, the fifth one red color of cambery glass is due to so here manganese dioxide chromic oxide gold and nickel oxide answer is c that is gold chloride gives red color of uh, red color to the cambery glass okay now so if we use uh, manganese dioxide in glass which gives purple color to the glass okay and if we use nickel oxide in glass which import violet color to the glass okay so just check all these important uh, points okay now sixth question nylon 66 so 6 comma 6 just write it not 66 nylon 6 comma 6 is made from hexamethylene diamine and so the answer here is adipoyl chloride okay so here we have given with different uh, monomers ethylene glycol adipoyl chloride styrene dimethyl 1 comma 4 benzene dicarboxylate the answer is adipoyl chloride okay right and seventh question the conversion of hot water into soft water by boiling or adding calcium hydroxide is called Clark's process Baker's process Faber's process contact process the answer is Clark's process okay just check all other three options and where they can be used okay right next question the particle with highest penetrating power is so here we have given with alpha particle beta gamma and all options the answer is so the highest penetrating power is with gamma rays or gamma particles because gamma particles are considered as neutral that's why they can they have highest penetrating power when we compare with alpha and beta particles my next question uh, the particle with highest ionizing power is so here same alpha beta gamma particles are given the answer is alpha particle okay so alpha particle has highest ionizing power and next question alpha particle can't penetrate through so here skin paper aluminium all so which is the correct answer so simply d is the correct answer because alpha particle has low very low penetrating power that's why it cannot penetrate through skin paper and metal aluminium okay so that's why here option d is the correct answer next question bio fertilizers convert nitrogen into ammonia nitrate amino acids and nitrites okay so simply here bio fertilize uh, bio fertilizers convert nitrogen into ammonia so option a is the correct answer which drug is used as cardiovascular drug here we have given with enalapril ibuprofen and uh, cepamycin ampotericin okay the answer is a that is enalapril is used as a cardiovascular drug okay here ibuprofen is used as anti-inflammatory drug and cepamycin used, used as antibacterial drug and ampotericin used as antifungal drug okay and next question the radioactive element is used in heart pacemakers is here plutonium 238 uh, deuterium plutonium 235 and thorium answer is a okay plutonium 238 used in heart pacemakers okay right and next question acid rain is used due to pollution of atmosphere by so we have four options oxides of carbon and nitrogen oxides of nitrogen and sulfur oxides of carbon and methane oxides of carbon and chlorofluorocarbons okay so acid rain is caused by oxides of nitrogen and sulfur that is the formation of uh, nitric acid and sulfuric acids okay 
right and next question which metal gives hardness to stainless steel here we have given with tin zinc carbon and copper answer is c that is carbon can give hardness to stainless steel next question the acid in ants sting is citric acid formic acid hydrochloric acid acetic acid answer is formic acid and next question growing of plants without soil by using minerals in water is called aerophonics hydrophonics eutrophication and infiltration answer is hydrophonics okay so just uh, know about aerophonics and uh, eutrophication okay and next question the glass is used to make laboratories utensils like beakers and flasks etc is here we have given with uh, soda glass okay and uh, uh, potash glass pyrex glass okay so here we have given with three only just check them so soda glass is used in making drinking glasses and windows etc whereas uh, a potash glass used in uh, eye glasses tv or computer monitors okay so pyrex glass that is borosilicate glass or hard glass is used to make laboratory utensils like beakers and flasks and etc okay so the answer is c here and next question the process galvanization is to protect so iron by coating with zinc iron by coating with copper zinc by coating with iron iron by coating with chromium so the answer is iron is protected by coating with zinc and next question the chemical compound in detergent is sodium n do desyl sulfate sodium n deca uh, desyl sulfate and sodium stearate and sodium maleate answer is sodium n do desyl sulfate next question water gas is a mixture of uh, carbon monoxide plus n2 nitrogen and co plus h2 co plus methane and co plus acetylene answer is co plus h2 here co plus n2 is called as producer gas okay right the cathode in a dry cell is made of zinc carbon cadmium copper so simply the answer is carbon and anode in dry cell is made of zinc okay next question which method is used to kill germs parasites in drinking water distillation boiling chlorination filtration here the answer is chlorination so by sending chlorine gas into the water so it kills germs parasites in drinking water next question which uh, is called blocked lead in the following graphite oxide of lead tin lead sulfide answer is graphite next question synthetic polymer used in bulletproof glass is lexon melamine perspex pvc answer is lexon option a is the correct answer for the given problem so get subscription and uh, like and share my videos so to get more updates and more series of videos on general science chemistry and to get or uh, to join best online courses for various competitive examinations of chemistry visit chemmasters.online or download mobile app and join the courses to get guaranteed success thank you very much